All mine. I'm old lady Gibson, or so they tell me. I've got odds and ends for sale, and I'm pretty good at fixing things, too. You might have noticed the very large building just north of here. That's Helios 1. The NCR runs the place, so it's off limits to prospectors. Sure thing. Let me have a look. it seems like I spent the better portion of my youth in that old wreck of a building. Me and my hubby, may the man rest in peace, used to scavenge there. <laughs> if it weren't bolted down, you can bet we took it and sold it. A lot of the scrap you see around here is from Repcon, even my favorite chair. 
The way I heard it, the Brotherhood of Steel ran the place before the NCR took it away from them. I'm not sure who started shooting first. But when it was over, the Brotherhood, with all their fancy armor and weapons, was on the run. Nobody's heard from them since. Well, I'll give you a hint. They used to just call me Gibson. I hope you can figure out the rest. I don't mind, to be honest. Living long is a real accomplishment these days. Remains to be seen if I end up dying peaceful in my bed. Happy to do it. Another satisfied customer. Take care now. Subject E, diagnosis complete. Begin recording. My name is Whitley. I'm a researcher at Adams Air Force Base. Until recently, I was in charge of the DiraFrame reinforcement project for the combat model iBots. iBot DiraFrame Subject E is both the prototype and the last functional model in this test group. I was prepared to make several significant upgrades to the machines. However, as the project was canceled and all DiraFrame assets are being diverted to Hellfire Armor, I am sending this model to the Navarro Outpost. If you're listening to this log from one of our Enclave outposts in Chicago, Give this unit whatever repairs it needs, so it can continue to Navarro. This is a restricted area. State your business. Or you're a Legion spy trying to infiltrate our perimeter. Give me one good reason I should let you through. No need. We already have an expert hard at work on it. Then again, our expert is an idiot. Hell, he might as well be a saboteur. I guess you couldn't do any worse. Have him fill you in on the details. He's in the back of the building. You'll know him when you see him. Keeps his sunglasses on all the time, even when he's sleeping. I ask myself the same question all the time. But energy is hard to come by around here. Gives you more control over this area than troops ever could. Hell, if we lose the dam to the Legion, this little plant may be our last stand. There should, but we're not getting much power out of it, so none of our enemies have big interest in it either. Not like Hoover Dam, anyway. We had a real fighting force here just long enough to take it from the Brotherhood of Steel. Then they got sent east to the dam like everybody else. Caesar's Legion sends skirmishers every so often, prodding for weaknesses mostly. The reality is, if they really wanted it, we'd all be dead. Damned if I know. Put up a hell of a fight, though. We had them outnumbered, I don't know, 20 to 1 maybe? They held out as long as they could, lost most of their force before they retreated gave us a little parting gift, too. They had some of the plant running, but they shut it all down. Enabled an old security system, too, to keep us away from the controls. <sighs> Jerk-offs. Later.
Pretty sure HQ's forgotten all about us. Who the hell are you? They bring you in to replace me? They're replacing me, aren't they? Damn right you're not. God damn right. Why would they? You can't top this guy. Just a little more time. You can't keep Fantastic down for long. What else? I'm in charge. This whole operation depends on me. No Fantastic, no power. Got the whole NCR suckling my teats. And it feels so good. Fuck, man. Everything. I push buttons, I turn dials, I read numbers. Sometimes I make up little stories in my head about what the numbers mean. Like one time I imagined they were a code to get into a vault full of naked women. Man, how cool would that be? No, man. I know exactly what I'm doing. I just don't know what effect it's going to have. Over there, controls power in this building. That station has readouts on the computer network. That big knob there makes a crazy noise. Uh, sparks come out of that slot if you put stuff in it. And I'm learning more every day. Worried? Do I look worried to you? I've got this under control, baby. No one else can do what I do here. 
Well, see, we're getting power because the guy running this place is fantastic. But the mirrors outside aren't aimed right, so we're running at 1% efficiency, and I guess that just isn't good enough for some assholes. Trouble is, most of the controls for this place aren't here. They're in the tower. And that place has some crazy pre-war security system that the dumb shit NCR set off when they took over. Killed two guys. Now they won't go near it. They want me to make an omelet, but I can't break any of their eggs. Know what I'm saying? It was easy, man. They were going door to door asking if anyone knew any scientists. I said look no further. They asked me if I knew anything about power plants. I said as much as anyone I had ever met. They asked me how well I understood theoretical physics. I said I had a theoretical degree in physics. They said, welcome aboard. There's these two terminals outside. They control the mirrors. I tried fooling with them, but didn't get very far. You'd have to get them to talk to the mainframe up in the tower, then do the rest from up there. I'm guessing, but it sounds good, right? Hey, you're not thinking about going up there, are you? Well, hey, if you find yourself up at the mainframe, do yourself a favor and make sure you send the power to the right place. It needs to go to the Strip and McCarran. Because I get paid, that's why, per kilowatt hour, whatever the hell that is. That's where the NCR wants the power, so that's where I want it. But you know, you do that, maybe I put in a good word for you with them. Fantastic's little helper. There's a reputation you can hang your hat on. Here. you want this. It's the password to one of the terminals outside. Found it written on one of the stalls in the bathroom. It's unusual to see a new face here. Are you a soldier or a scientist? Then we have that in common. Whom do you typically work with? Very well, yes. I'm part of the followers of the apocalypse. If you're not familiar, we seek peace and the spread of knowledge. Knowledge that must never be lost to the world. Now your turn. Then for everyone's sake, I hope you serve a worthy master. Are you a maker of war or peace? That's reassuring. Although many who've made that claim to the followers of the Apocalypse over the years have had less than pure intentions. But if it's really as you say, then take my advice. This installation carries with it dangers that no one here has realized. Take care of what you do here and who you listen to. Some things are best left buried with the old world. Then I would say do it. As long as the power of this plant is committed to the regional grid and not to a weapon, we are safe. If you're the one to restore output, then you can route the power where you choose, and they'll never be the wiser. I can't get you past the security in the tower, but I can be of some help. I've discovered a password for one of the mirror control terminals outside. You'll need it. Oh, the NCR has their own designs for it, no doubt but resist the urge to send it only to the thriving communities. The need for power is great everywhere. Distributing it evenly is the most rational and humane choice. I'm a man of letters. I'd be torn to pieces by the security system they have in that tower. I'd never reach the mainframe. But eventually, the NCR will. Or if not them, Caesar's Legion. They will use this place for war. Because the possibility exists, you might do anything else. You're the only choice I have. I was sent here when we saw that the NCR had taken it. We have no record of the facility, but its original builders were cause for concern. I'm to determine the threat level of this place and do everything in my power to prevent the revival of any dangerous pre-war technology. The NCR let me stay because they are desperate for answers about this place, but I've kept them in the dark. I was sent here when we saw that the NCR had taken it. We have no record of the facility, but its original builders were cause for concern. I'm to determine the threat level of this place and do everything in my power to prevent the revival of any dangerous pre-war technology. The NCR let me...
I don't entirely know. Our records on the company that built this place suggest that their dealings were not only in energy, but also in weapons. And I've seen equipment here marked with symbols used by the pre-war military. Targeting computers, shock sensors. A code word comes up repeatedly in the papers I've looked through here. Archimedes. Yes, and the technology they have in this facility is like nothing I've seen. Some of it reminds me of Enclave equipment, but more advanced. A weapon based upon it would be catastrophic, no matter who claimed it. It's no wonder the Brotherhood wouldn't give it up. They weren't here for me to ask, but I doubt they were here for electricity. When the NCR first came here, it was under Brotherhood control. They usually steered clear of one another, but something here changed their minds. The Brotherhood's interest in pre-war technology has always been in weapons. It's likely they were trying to reclaim Archimedes when the NCR arrived. Not yet. By some miracle, they've hired an imbecile to try and decipher the systems here. He spent months working at one console trying to get the solar reflectors to track the sun. What he doesn't know is that the only thing the console controls is the plant's intercom system. I tried to tell him, but he insisted that the largest console had to be the most important. Still, it's only a matter of time. Humanity lost many things after the war. Methods of agriculture, techniques for survival. We took it upon ourselves to piece together this knowledge and bring it back to them. Other things weren't lost, but were blocked from our collective memory. Knowledge of what we're capable of and how things spiral out of control. It's in our nature to want to forget truths that keep us awake at night. And for that reason, it's all the more important that the followers walk the ways to remind people of them. We did for a time, but our goals differ. The NCR only cares to expand their wealth and their reach. For us, territory boundaries mean nothing, and prosperity has to be for everyone, not just citizens of the NCR. So parting was inevitable. While the NCR pushes east, we clean up the mess they leave behind, try to provide some stability. We're scattered mostly. We go where we're needed. Our largest presence is in Freeside at Old Mormon Fort. Other than that, I know Dr. Usanagi set up a practice near the Crimson Caravan, and a man we train is operating out of the Aerotech building. Another man, Tom Anderson, was looking into water supply problems in Westside, but that was a while ago. Goodbye. Which side the Legion's gonna hit us from next?
This place is off limits to civilians. You don't like it, take it up with Lieutenant Haggerty.
Fine by me. What can I help you with? I saw that on the monitors here, and you sent it to everyone. Very admirable. Now that the NCR has more or less what they want, hopefully their curiosity about the plan is satisfied, and they'll dig no deeper. The followers will be grateful. Here, take these as a parting gift. I hope you'll find them useful. Yo. Adios, amigo. Don't go quietly. The Legion can count on that.
What is it? Later. What can I do for you? Yeah, and I... Thanks. Bye.
Fine by me. Fine by me.
careful. They got spies all over. Your travel's been going... Watch your six out there. Hey there. Any word on Station Charlie? What? What happened? Those were good men at that station. Good men. This whole town was sleeping a lot easier because of them. Now, who knows what we're in for. The Legion? Christ. We'd be better off with raiders. Well, thanks for telling me. I know that knowledge didn't come without risk. Here, take this. Courtesy of the Ranger Veterans Fund. Look out for yourself. Welcome. Come on in. I don't know if you know, but since Jeannie May passed, I've been keeping an eye on her properties for her. I think it's time we gave everything back to you, so take this key and make yourself at home at our motel. It'll open the room on the second floor, closest to the lobby. Uh, hope it suits you. Sure thing. Have a look. Come back soon now.
Not my strong suit, but yeah, you and me, fine by me. Welcome back. Gonna get killed her. Why would you do something like that? Lord Almighty, I can't for the life of me imagine her doing anything that'd make someone want to kill her. Not that I'm saying you're a liar, of course. I'm just surprised, is all. Will there be anything else? Come back soon now. What's going on, man? Yeah, see ya. <laughs>